What are Periscope and Meerkat? This is episode 182 of the Marketing for Owners podcast. It's me, John. You can find all of the details on the website, marketingforowners.com. But if you really want to know how the entire perpetual sales cycle system works, you want to see it in play for free with no obligation, no nothing, go to marketingforowners.com forward slash 71 tools, 71 tools. You will come across our report, which is actually brilliant, by the way. I've never had a report like that, so that for the giveaway for free, that so many people have emailed and said, thanks, that's great. Just a simple thanks, really short emails. So it's popular. It's all the stuff that we and or I and my team and my staff use every single day. Virtually everything in there is free. There is no catch. You don't try to sell you a thing. But that's how the system works. Go get it. Anyway, going on about Periscope and Meerkat. You may have heard of Periscope especially. And when we're talking about Meerkat, we're talking about the app. These are live streaming apps. Now I'm instantly going to discount Meerkat, poor Meerkat, uh, because although they're doing fine, I'm sure someone will buy them out eventually, Periscope was bought by Twitter just before it actually launched. And in, uh, at the time of this recording, Facebook Live or Facebook Mentions has just been called, I think, it's, I think they want to call it Facebook Mentions, which is their version, although it's only been launched to mega personalities with verified accounts. And so people like me, simple people like me, can't get my hands on it but they'll get it out to everyone eventually once they've ironed out the glitches. But Periscope is the fella at the moment. Meerkat does the same. Live streaming apps. So in effect, or in reality, um, what you can do, if you've got a Twitter account, just download the Periscope app for free. It connects with your Twitter account. So you press a button, say, I am going to Periscope. Hold your iPhone in front of you, camera on you, camera on whatever you want to look at. Uh, some people hold it pointing at a, at a computer screen if they want to show something on a computer. I've seen people unbox stuff. They've just got a brand new product come in the post or in, by shipping and they unbox it. They hold it and, and show everyone what they got. But you put in a title of what it's about, hit the start. That will pitch out to anyone on your Twitter stream And if you put your location in, people will be looking around. They will just find it. People will watch your Periscope. It is called scoping. It is going to be huge. It's an instant hit. If Twitter are going to buy it for $100 million before it even launches, it's going to be huge. To the point, some uh, some sports organisations, I think the... uh, uh, NFL, I think, uh, perhaps, or the NHL, have already banned people from periscoping at the games because they, they want to hold on to all the broadcast rights so they can sell expensive advertising. As if sitting in the back row of a hockey game, an ice hockey game, um, on an iPhone, people are going to be able to watch that and prefer to do that than watching their TV. But I've seen periscopes of people's speeches at conferences Um, I've also heard of others using it very imaginatively where someone goes to a sales pitch to to pitch to a company and the company have other branches and periscope the actual sales pitch so that other of their staff in other offices can see the pitch without having to hop on an aeroplane and come along. Now on these things the person giving the talk can talk and do whatever they want but they can't Um, They can't text or anything, but all the people watching can put in text comments. Now, if you get some spammers or nasty people or people uh, swearing or whatever, you can simply click a button and block the, the people. But people give you, viewers give you hearts. People can... Uh, can tap, 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 tap the screen and it gives you hearts and gives you love. People can also swipe side to side on an iPhone, uh, up and down on an Android, I believe, and, and share it on Twitter, share it to their friends and say, hey, come along, this is great, come watch this. 
Now, the other thing is that these uh, live stream events are recorded but they're only available in the replay for 24 hours. So I advise you get a catch.me account. Catch is spelt with a K, K-A-T-C-H dot me account for free. That will link with your Periscope account and will record these. Then you'll get an embed video, which you can put on your website or do whatever with. You can also uh, build, uh, use that or use the link from Twitter and put it into a template and put it up on YouTube. Personally, I wouldn't put everything on YouTube because these are quite often rough and ready, like these podcast videos, but Periscope is going to be the bee's knees. Now, the reason Meerkat is still around is because a lot of the larger brands, Meerkat was there first, a lot of the large brands use it. However, for the masses, it's just simple to use Periscope with your Twitter account because it, it gives you an instant audience of anyone who follows you on Twitter. And same with Facebook. If you've got a large Facebook following, if you get onto Facebook mentions, it's going to give you an instant audience. But everyone, everyone, every app is trying to get you onto video. So that is the way the world is going. You need to think, how can I use this for my business? If you want some top people to follow on Periscope, I'm going to recommend a couple of, uh, a couple of English guys. One is Alex Pettit, uh, P-E-T-T-I-T-T. Another is Mark Shaw. Both of these guys were around on the day, or with Mark Shaw, the day after Periscope was launched. So they're originals, which means they have a huge following, but they're also very good at it. Both uh, scope two or three times a day, I think Mark Shaw even more. Uh, but uh, Alex Pettit, I think, has possibly got more hearts than anyone else, like 50 million. That's a lot. So follow them. Another one is Kim Garst, G-A-R-S-T. She actually has a product and a freebie and gives a good summary of what Periscope is. But watch what they do and how to use it, because they will give you good advice on some simple, simple tips. So remember, join up to match.me. Sorry, not match. What am I talking about? I'm not match either. Catch.me. Have a, a little, if you want to uh, say a hashtag or a, a URL, have a little whiteboard and write it on it and have it there ready. Ask people when they're on it to share and explain to them how to share via Twitter while you're on it. Also, ask people to follow you, explain how to follow. So if you go on to this and look up me by the name John Butt, J-O-N-B-U-T-T, or you look up our Twitter handle, which is at Marketing Owners, couldn't fit the four in, Twitter has a character limit. Look up those on Periscope, and you'll see a little head come up, you can just, or a little follow, you can just follow. Um, Periscope will tell you when stuff is streaming that you want to follow. It's clever like that. It's very addictive, by the way, I warn you. It is very addictive. But So tell people to follow you. Tell people to share. Um, ask people for comments. Ask people questions. Give them value. Don't waste their time. Don't show them that you're just watching TV or messing about. But give it some personality. The thing, this is what a lot of you are going to get stuck with. The thing people like about Periscope is it puts people in the raw. Kind of like this video. No tricks, no... Uh, yeah, I don't... You know, I'm out in the... Out here by the golf course with a gorse bush behind me. Or something. No, fir, fir bush. Uh, I've got a simple mic on me. I've got an iPhone. I've got a tripod. I've got no lighting. No makeup. No, honestly, I look like this. No makeup. No people. There's no one helping. I have no tools whatsoever. And that's the same with Periscope, it's raw. Yes, you can put your makeup on, yes, you can brush your hair, but who cares where you are? You can do it from anywhere you've got a connection. You will be amazed how many people will follow you. I, for one, will be putting out material on, on Periscope and will be putting it out regularly. And I will be following the experts and following best practice. I recommend you do to that as well. It is a Tuesday. You will not, therefore, be. <laughs> you will not be surprised when today's Tuesday 
toolbox tip is Periscope. You can look at Meerkat. I may be giving it a disservice. It may come up with some fabulous features that make it un unmissable. But to be honest, all I hear about is Periscope. Go for it. Try it. What have you got to lose? It's free. See you Wednesday.